Hello, it's Lucy, and today I'm going to be giving you a tour of Northwestern University dining halls. All freshmen and sophomores are required to be on the unlimited meal plan, and this includes unlimited access to the dining halls. You can just eat as much as you want while you're there, and you can also take out to-go boxes if you're in the rush or you just want to eat somewhere else. And in addition, the meal plan also includes five meal exchange options that you can use at different restaurants on campus. And I created another video about that. So if you haven't seen it, definitely check it out. And let's get started. First up, we have Sarge, which is a dining hall on North Campus. It's located right near Tech. So if you have any classes in Tech, it's a perfect place to stop by and grab something to eat. Although it does tend to be pretty busy during lunchtime, especially when classes are letting out. Sometimes it's known to have lines all the way out the building, but it's definitely worth it. It's one of the best dining halls on campus and you can't beat the location. Next up, we have Elder Dining Hall, which is the most northern dining hall on campus and it really gives off restaurant vibes with the booths and the low lighting. It also has a red and black theme going on, which I really like, and the food here tends to be pretty good. Next up, we have Foster Walker, which is also known as Plex. Plex has two sides, and this is Plex West, which is known for having comfort food, flame, sandwiches, and more. There's also Plex East, which is known for having pure eats for anyone who has allergies or just wants to eat healthier. And Plex East also has the stir fry, where you can make your own stir fry and they will fry it up for you right on the spot. But unfortunately, when I was there, Plex East was closed. Next up is Allison Dining Hall, which is located on South Campus, right across from the Arch. It's a great place to meet up with friends and grab some lunch or dinner. There's upstairs and downstairs seating, and there's a ton of different options to choose from. However, it does tend to get crowded during lunch, and there are often lines going out the building. So those are all of the different dining halls we have on campus. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and I'll see you next time. Bye.